Question 29. Given the functions f of x equals x squared minus 1 and g of x equals x plus 1, state the domain of g of x divided by f of x. So I don't know why they're putting it out of order here, but let's just write the function that we're supposed to have. x plus 1 goes on top because that's g of x, and x squared minus 1 goes on bottom. So this is a domain question, so all we're really concerned with is stating the non-permissible values and using those to uh, find the domain. So this is a difference of squared. The square is x minus 1 times x plus 1. So if we look at the uh, denominator here, we want to solve the denominator. So basically the NPVs, or the non-permissible values, are x equals 1, x equals negative 1. So we should clearly state what the domain is. The domain x is a real number, except x cannot equal uh, negative 1 and x cannot equal positive 1. Um, so that's stating the domain in a manner where we say what x cannot equal. Some people also prefer to state the domain saying what x can equal. So we could also state this as uh, our domain being from negative infinity to negative 1 open brackets because neither is included union negative 1 to 1 keep the black brackets open and union 1 to infinity I could see why with rational functions most people prefer domain stated this way.